NBC4 Investigates has the internal affairs file for the Columbus police officer who shot Donovan Lewis. Lewis was unarmed and in his bed when he was killed August 30th by Officer Ricky Anderson. And Anderson was part of a team serving a warrant charging Lewis with assault, domestic violence, and improperly handling a firearm. NBC4 investigates Jamie Ostroff has been digging through Columbus police records to learn more about Anderson, a 30-year veteran of the department. What did you find? Yes, now this is a follow-up to that personnel file we received last week. The internal affairs file is different. I found in it 12 violations of department policy. That includes five regarding the operation of a vehicle, stemming from three separate incidents between 2013 and 2019. And in 2018, Internal Affairs found Anderson acted outside department policy with his use of a taser. This file offers little or no context on the circumstances surrounding the violations. For example, there were two findings of a violation of rules, orders, etc., but no mention of the rule that was violated. Two more violations of policy were just listed as internal investigation. Now, this file also does not mention any disciplinary action, which could be anything from retraining, a written reprimand, or a departmental charge. I requested more records surrounding those internal affairs investigations that resulted in a finding of a violation of department policy. Of course, as soon as I get that information on what happened, I'll share it with you. The Columbus Division of Police is not commenting any further on the shooting of Donovan Lewis Anderson, for that is currently on leave pending an investigation.